Okay, uh, now that I have uh, the washers I need for these longer bolts, and I've got the multiple size drill bits I need to countersink the last 10 millimeters of that bolt, I can now lock down the mounts for the solar light. I use this tool, which I just purchased to remove the solar light from its bracket. So I need to go out a second time and get another tool because I wasn't prepared for that special mount. So here we go. I'm going to get this locked down tight. I'm just going to put this one in my pocket. I've got two of them up here already. I'm using the socket to lock it onto the column to make this a lot harder to steal. I could just do two bolts because that's really secure enough. Somebody could just come in here with a drill gun and remove this in about three minutes. In fact, I was thinking of using the drill gun to lock this down, but the problem is, is you can over torque things with a drill. So you could wind up snapping off the bolt just by trying to lock it down fast. Take your time, lock it down slow, and you won't snap the bolt off. And you won't wind up over torquing your wrist when the bolt locks up inside this super heavy duty column here. Uh, this, this is the kind of column you see in those Kung Fu movies where it's so strong that people break limbs on the column. Yeah, you, you could damage a car with this thing. This thing is really super solid. So right now, I'm just working this bolt in, feeling the torque to make sure that I've countersunk that correctly. Now that's tight. This one's not there yet. That one is better. I think I'm gonna go with that. So now, I'm gonna show you that. So, in the interest of saving time, all right, so that one doesn't have a washer, that was just the, the, the bolt that held everything on. Then, we got one over here and one over here, and they have washers on them. And now that is locked down. This is where I snapped off the bolt earlier because the hole wasn't large enough and I didn't countersink it well enough. So mistakes will be made, but you know what? That's really solid now. And now I can put that back together. I think I just turned it crooked. Yes, I did. So forgive me if you didn't like the idea that that was crooked. So there it is. Uh, uh. Not at 90 degrees anymore. Now, back to the solar light. The question was, did the solar panel actually work? And this thing was dead in the store. And the answer is yes, it's perfect, it's working. So now we put it all back together. 